I um I programmed the snails in uh, Game Maker. Uh, uh, so it will randomise which snails come out. Um, so a new one will come out. And I've also got a button that makes them extra random if I want to. And I, I, to use it with OBS, I've had to use had to use auto hotkey to send commands to the little game program I made. Anyway, in case anyone's interested in the snails, I'll, just, I'll let one more snail go past, and then I'll get rid of it. Anyway, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. I do want the snails to disappear to a puff of smoke. I've just got to draw that. Um, anyway. There's a layer of cement at the bottom. Hmm. Oh, wow, I can solve that. I don't think it'll do much good unless I light it first. That's a good point. Um, what happened to my lighter? I had matches earlier. I guess I lost them. Hmm. That doesn't seem to work. That's not such a great idea. Ah! It north from the dinosaur to the pile of rocks. Hi, Herman. Oh, hi. I think I have an answer to the philosophical puzzle you posed for me. All right. What is it? Eggshell? Nah. Driftwood? Nope. Sumac? Not even close. Mustard? Not exactly. Alpaca? Nope. Evening haze? Nah. Tarragon? Not even close. Red? Not even close. Blue? Nope. Juniper? Nah. Venetian? Nope. Sweet potato? Not exactly. I give up. Think about it some more and come back when you have an answer. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain. Hmm. I'm curious what happens if you leave the um, X All by I different directions. Let's make a map and tear it into four pieces. Ow. Fair enough. And you count the mazes in this series. Okay, and you can't leave via the south. No, I like this. Uh, I've got a love bomb as well. I'm pretty sure that's for no. the end. I want to oh, save I've... it for Elaine. That's the last match. Didn't realize I. Great Scott! from the direction of Dinky Island. That idiot must be messing with my grandfather's treasure. Ah, oh, I'd better get over there. Didn't realize that matches on me still. Oh, look, we've reached the start of the game. I save my game because it's going to be audio commentary, obviously. Uh, why wouldn't there be for that moment? I'm curious. I, like, the way they do the commentary, they must be watching somebody play, like videos and stuff. Like, I'm confused on why it's only, like, few select scenes. I mean, I appreciate you might not want to spend an hour doing commentary, but it would be nice. I can't reach that from here. I can't reach that from here. Okay. It's a rope. I just have to recreate the... Which I'm saying, um... I can't get up there. I can't get up there. Shaky. Looks as shaky as the one I'm standing on. Hmm. That doesn't seem to work. I don't think it'll catch on there. I don't think it'll catch on there. That doesn't seem to work. Jump, you coward! I can't reach that from here. No. I want to save it for Elaine. I don't think that would be very sporting. What do you mean it wouldn't be very sporting? I think that would be very sporting. For the monkey! I can't reach that from here. I don't know how to play. That doesn't seem to work. 
I can't reach that from here. Mm. I can't get up there. We do something and she catches us, I assume. It's too soggy. Yeah, I didn't realize we wrote this all down here. Why didn't you do it on the clean piece of paper? I had a, I had a clean Why? one right here. I can't reach that from here. I can't reach that from here. I can't reach that from here. It's open. That doesn't seem to work. Okay, so what I've got to consider is he... Like, it's definitely not these two because... These three I could have just left. This is something he deliberately picked up. Um, that would have been perfect. I'm not entirely sure why that did not work. Oh, we've used up all the drink. Let's I drink the... Suck that. No, I suppose not. Um, what am I not doing? Go on, John. Shaky. They look sturdy, apart from being all bent up. This might make a nice wall hanging. Looks strong. Looks strong. I don't think it'll catch on there. Okay, so I use this with... That doesn't seem to work. There. There we, we go. go. I'm being a fool. Yeah, I got it. I forgot you have to combine items sometimes. Ah! There we go. We've reached the start of the game. Probably shouldn't do this over for a cutscene. The last part. Okay, I just did that in a weird order, but whatever. I think it was... 8.15, okay. And you showed up about three days later. Will you help me now? Anything to shut you up. That has to have been the longest story I ever heard. <laughs> ah! I know, I, know, I know what to do for this oh, bit. Dear because uh, Monkey Island 3 ends with the same puzzle. Fact, I'm at the point where I could probably... Um... I assume we're going to be in the underground passage. Oh, hang on. Uh, we need some way of making light. Make the screen smaller. I can't see a thing. You find yourself in a dark room. Uh, that is a nice looking beard. How can you see? You can't see a beard. That doesn't seem to work. I attack the darkness. Uh, is it a light-producing monkey that I'm holding? See, this one, if I click off screen, then... Ah, uh, it'll alt-tab, and I don't want it to. I can't see a thing. Oh, he knows not to look at that. I can't see a thing. I can't see a thing. I can't see a thing. I'm, I'm getting a general theme. I can't see a thing. 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 I can't see a thing.
There are no yeah. more matches. Okay, I, I didn't realize I was looking because I was using the old system and not actually trying to use stuff. Um, I'm out of matches, but I might be able to make a spark. Who knows what enormous deadly cave creature I'd wake up? No thanks. A grew. Um, that is a nice looking beard. Hmm. No. I want to save it for Elaine. There are no more matches. Hmm. That doesn't seem to work. What, what, what am I forgetting? What, what am I not considering? God damn it. I can't see a thing. Ooh. Eek. Hello, Guybrush. Oh, fuck. Fuck, that was commentary. I missed it. Hang on, I might be able to still do it. Do you remember these rooms? It was just one background and we turn on and off Is the it doors. Yeah, yeah, Generic yeah. room technology Pseudo for Indy and Indy 4. Yeah, I think we had a patent on that. Pseudo rooms? <laughs> you can see it there when it flashes like that. You can yeah, see, see that's when it was weird when you cut from one to the other because certain things would not change and other things would change. Because it was originally like an Indy 4 where you go through the castle. You go into a room, then you go into a hallway, then you mm -hmm. go into another room you don't mm -hmm. see it. Right. That was such a great game. Oh, it was Indy 3. Indy 3. Last Crusade. Yeah, Last Crusade. That's yeah. when you go in the cat in the. Yeah. The well, Last Crusade game. was when we first started doing the little dialogue. That was the, yeah, you mentioned things. the dialogue puzzles. Yeah, and then I think, I think in in Monkey One. I think we, it was almost like the whole concept was proved out in a way, and then I think we went nuts on Monkey Two with the dialogues. Mm -hmm. Cool. Right. Yeah. This entire section I remember quite well. Apart from the light switch, obviously, which I did not consider. Would you mind not spitting so much when you talk? You won't escape me this time. I escaped from you before. I can easily do it again. Not so fast. Even if you were to escape, I would always be able to find you again. We are bound to one another. Like dreadlocks? Yes, rather like that. Or like... Brothers. <gasps> huh? I am your brother. No, no. That's not true. That's impossible. Search your feelings. You know it to be true. No! No! And I brought a little surprise for you. So... When I played this game, I don't think I would have known that was a Star Wars reference. I wouldn't have gotten any of them. Uh, I think you being my brother is enough of a surprise for one day. Mm, perhaps, but humor me. Say. That wouldn't happen to be a voodoo doll, would it? Why, yes, as a matter of fact, it is a voodoo doll, which I'll be using to torture you, and then send you screaming to another dimension, one of infinite pain. Observe. Ah! Are you quite finished? No. I want to do this. That was exhilarating. Let's have some more fun, shall we? <laughs> oh, please, no more. Okay, time to send you screaming to a dimension of infinite pain. At last, I'm rid of that pesky little wimp guybrush. Hey, I'm alive. Hey. I thought I was a goner. Oops. Strange. There must be something wrong with my voodoo doll. It was supposed to send you to another dimension, not the next room. Huh. Shoddy materials, I'll bet. Well, I guess I'll just try it again. Uh, no. That's okay. I... Cool. 
cool. Um, let's make ourselves a voodoo doll, shall we? Oh, root beer. I think it's useless this time. I love root beer. I don't want to carry a whole box. One bottle of root beer should be sufficient. Hey, there's only one balloon in here. I'll just take one. Hmm. That's just a cheap little doll with no voodoo powers at all. What? All of them? What? All of them? Sure, why not? So I want a piece of the dead, uh, a piece of the thread, a piece of the body, and a piece of the head, and a piece of bread to honor the dead. It says, first aid this way. Oh, who am I to? Yeah, I found my lost parents. Holy cow, these are my parents. Dad looks a bit looser. Hi, Dad. Hi, Mom. The bones are all connected to each other. God, I bet people hated the ending to this game. Not the puzzle, ah. just the twist. Gotcha. I know you're upset. Wait a second. <laughs> You remember these rooms? It was just one background and we... Hey, Guybrush. Uh, can't we talk this over? Is that what the big whoop is then? Just the ticket? It says E on it. Interesting. That doesn't seem to work. Nine hundred pounds. Nine hundred pounds. It's nailed shut. It looks very big and heavy. I think it's a bit heavy for me. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. When I say I remember this, Let's discuss this like rational adults. <laughs> I remember that you have to make a voodoo doll, which the game makes pretty obvious, to be honest. Oh, there's stuff in it. It's a pair of surgical gloves. Hmm. I can't move it. Aha! Gotcha! There's a syringe in here. Um... Uh, Good. You sure you want to do this? Nope. Out of order. I don't know what I want them for yet. It's already open.
Ah, right. A double eagle. What a find. Fuck. Ah, caught you. Um, uh, let me explain. Okay, I've got to... It's jam. Got to do this first. That might actually summon him. I think actually seven games is probably a good idea, actually. Must be a pretty small railroad. It's already open. It's most likely full of technological wonders. There's nothing to pick up. It's most likely full of technological wonders. It's probably full of tools and useful stuff. It's too heavy for me to lift. I can't pick that up. It's nailed shut. It's nailed shut. I can't pick that up. Hmm. You can use the helium, I know that, but I'm trying to figure out why you do that. It's an that. attractive green color. Oh, there's a monkey in my pocket, and he's stealing all my change. His stare is blank and glassy, I suspect that he's deranged. Which is waiting on him. Oh, there he is. Ah, right, a double eagle. Ah. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. Uh, let me explain. Ah. Um. What are you doing? Ah, caught you. Um. I know you're upset. Right, we've investigated all the rooms, but we've not picked up everything yet. Hypodermic, uh, yeah, hypodermic nurdle, hypodemic nurdle. There we go. Uh, that wouldn't do anything. Now you're gonna get it. Uh, Let me explain. Uh, <laughs> Over here. I should push the little button. Well, how do we? You're gonna get it. Nine hundred pounds. Are uh, you sure you want to do this? <laughs> so. We have a piece of the dead and a piece of the uh, thread. Uh, so we need. Hang on. Something of the thread, something of the head, something of the body, and something of the dead. Something of the head. I don't even I don't know how to get either of those. Um... Hey, Guybrush. It's voodoo time! Um, I know you're upset. How come we don't?
don't have a coin? Or does it just go in our pile? Aha! Uh, are you sure you want to do this? <laughs> Hi, Mom. That doesn't seem to work. That doesn't seem to work. It says E on it. What's the helium for? Oh, there's a monkey in my pocket, and he's stealing all my change. His stare is blank and glassy, I suspect that he's deranged. Well, I'd rather be a pirate on scab than a scab on a pirate. Now you're in for it, you bilious bag of barnacle bait. That wouldn't be polite. I can't pick that up. I'd love to, but I'm kind of pressed for time. Beer should be sufficient. Aha! Caught you. Uh, let's discuss this like rational adults. <laughs> I'd get everything all sticky. I'd get everything all sticky. That doesn't seem to work. That doesn't seem to work. Uh, yeah, I don't know how to start putting things together or where I put things together. Um, I'll continue searching for the place. I conceptually understand that I'm making a voodoo potion. Or, or a voodoo doll, specifically. Better not. I'd really rather not. Looking costume. I can't reach that high. I can't reach that high. Aha! Caught you. Ah! Let's bury that. So he doesn't even react to corn anymore. Can't use the left until you've dealt with him. I straight up don't know what I'm supposed to do. Um, hey, Guybrush. It... You remember these rooms? It was just one background, and we turn on and off Is the it, doors. Uh, yeah, it's generic it's room technology. Indie, Indie Four. Yeah, I think we had. Two rooms. 
You can see it there when it flashes like that. You can yeah, see, see that's when it was weird when you cut from. Yeah. That doesn't seem to work. That doesn't seem to work. That's just a cheap little doll with no voodoo powers at all. That doesn't seem to work. How do I start combining? I'd stuff? get everything all sticky. I'd get everything all sticky. I need like a base to build things off. The juju back. Okay. Well, that's one ingredient. That's two ingredients. Uh. That's two ingredients in the doll. Okay. Well, I'd rather be a pirate on scab than a scab on a pirate. Hmm. Piece of... It's got some stuff in it. A doll, some underwear, a bone. How would I get his hat? It was, it was literally a piece of scalp. I want to do the ceiling somehow. Maybe the light switch. I've been in the dark enough for one day. What a jip. What do I want with a bunch of bits of broken treasure chest? That is a nice looking beer. Maybe Ash to life? They're not Ash, they're bones, so I don't think I'll work, but... You're gonna get it. Uh, let me explain. Uh, let me explain. I don't think it was meant for that. I don't think it was meant for that. Hmm. What is the needle for? The I better not. No, I want to save it for Elaine. Did we really never use the organ? I don't think I should use it indoors. That doesn't seem to work. What is the needle for? I can't move it. This is no time for playing doctor. Boy, does that look comfy. the needle on him. Maybe I could just grab the hat. Now you're gonna get it. Let's bury the hatchet. Let's buy gone to
Nice. Yeah. Gotcha. Um, there's no need for violence. I don't like loud noises. Oh, do we not have pins? So it's just our... Okay, it's just our substitute. So that is an interesting reaction. I'll try with a bit on him. I'd get everything all sticky. Try before, but now you're going to get it. I know you're upset. Um. You're gonna get it. Oh, uh, are you sure you want to do this? Okay, it might be that I'm giving, and I don't want to. Uh. I love root beer. Now you're gonna get it. Hold on. Have a look at the plaque. <laughs> Service elevator, 1,000 pound limit. I should push the little button. Nine hundred pounds. I can't move it. I should push the little button. Yeah, the game's telling me I need less stuff, probably. Um... I'd get everything all sticky. Get everything all sticky. If I press the hint button, it's going to tell me to make a voodoo doll. Ah, ah, gotcha. Let's bury the hatchet. There's a pause. Some... Ah, 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 ah. Ah. Need to put together a voodoo doll. I know. <laughs> I know I'm supposed to game. Collect... What? Something in my inventory to collect something from his body? gonna get it. Well, only drink part of it. Well, only drink part of it. Let's not be hasty. Uh, uh, I mean, I would have assumed it was the needle. Could take him with a broken bottle, though. Hey, Guybrush. It's voodoo time. Let's bury the hatchet. Um... Ah, yeah. 
That's great. Give the hanky? What the fuck? That makes sense and it's a good puzzle. No, I just good. never fucking would have thought about it. Uh, let's discuss this like rational adults. <laughs> like, I, I, like it, it does make sense, I won't lie. And it was an item that's never been used. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. Uh, here, try this. Isn't that better? <laughs> right. Gross. How? Three ingredients and the doll. Something of the head. That means it's hot. Let's think of the. Oh. Aha! Gotcha! I don't have a Take. use for it. Take. Um, hold on! I should push the little button. Hmm. Uh, parrot. I don't think that would be very sporting. Get everything all sticky. Now you're gonna get it. Um, there's no need for violence. I'll try the fishing pole, I guess. Time to be playing doctor. That doesn't seem to work. That doesn't seem to work. That doesn't seem to work. I don't want to suck that. That doesn't seem to work. Taking the sweet time, isn't he? Yeah, look, I could have, that was a clue in and of itself. Aha! Caught you. Let me explain. Uh, can't we talk this over? <laughs> Fine. You should be able to do something else in here. Oh, okay, I've got an no idea. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. I don't like loud noises. No. I know you're upset. Are you sure you want to do this? Oh, 
Oh, come on. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. Uh, uh, let's discuss this, like rational adults. Ah, 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 ah. 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 Carl, fuck hey, off, game. <laughs> it's voodoo time. Let bygones be bygones. W -w -w Wait a second. You're gonna get it. I'm Bob and Threadbear. Are you my mother? Uh, let me explain. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I know that game. Oh, I need a sample of his beard. Thread, head. Okay, I didn't know I was after his beard. Uh, that gives me. It wants me to be in that room, though, right? It looks like it's been here a long time. It's too heavy for me to lift. It looks like it's been here a long time. Think, John. That doesn't seem to work. Ah, oh, he's got a magical beard. Um, it's got some stuff in it. A doll, some underwear, a bone, thread, a dead. Tanky. I guess that's from the head. You know, I didn't think that through. It's from the body as well. It's a bit confusing. Beard. Oh fuck it. Let's. I've done that. Everything in my inventory has been exploded up. I don't think that'll work. It seems a bit inhumane. Um. Go to the elevator. What? What's that got to do with the helium? <laughs> it's just straight up told me what to do as well. Nice. Hey, Guybrush. It's voodoo time. Ow. Hey, hey. All right. Um, that's where the elevator didn't work before, so. There we go. I just had to straight up have the game tell me what to do. It's a bit of a shame, but <laughs> why, why was it making me do helium stuff? Um, this is hauntingly familiar. Yes. Uh, yeah. I was, somebody was watching me play the first game. And I told them to remember this scene. Ooh, a circus. I love a circus. That would be unlawful. It's good that they use the same background. Uh, I don't see anything special about it. Anyway, um...
Okay, brother, watch out, because I've got my own doll now. Why didn't that work a second ago? Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time! Ow. That's pretty good, Guybrush, but not good enough to stop me! That's impressive. Hey? Oh, it's you! What, that again? Ooh, look at me quaking in me booties. I laugh at you and your puny voodoo tinkerings. Aha! You don't scare me. You don't scare me. Come on. Take that, LeChuck! I'm much too powerful for you and your puny doll. I'm gonna kick your butt. What do you think about that? You know, this doll reminds me of the stretchy muscle man I had as a kid. No! Ah. You don't scare me. I wonder what would happen if I tore the leg off this thing. Ow! Ah. I... Ah. I suppose he is a zombie. Guybrush! <laughs> what? Come over here. No way. I'm not that stupid. But I want you to... <clears throat> take my mask off. Uh, see the true face of your brother. Leg or no leg, I trust you about as far as I can throw Manhattan. I tell you I'm... Uh, dying here. Take the mask off. No chance. It just rip my lungs out when I get close. No, no, I promise. Please, come take off the... Uh, the mask. Oh, all right. I'm coming over. Gently now. Remove my... Mask. My god, you're... My creepy brother, Chucky. What? Did you think I was kidding before? Why have you been chasing me all over the place? Our mother told me to hunt you down. How come you hate me as much as you obviously do? Well, you remember the time you broke my Junior Ultra Soldier Commando assault vehicle? No. Look, Guybrush, could you help me out? Stick the leg back on the doll, okay? Will you promise not to hold me down and spit on me anymore? All right, all right, I promise. Anything, just put my leg back on. Hey, you kids! You're not supposed to be in here. Ah, so there you are. This is where it yeah. all comes together and is explained mm -hmm. fully. I think people might not understand this ending because you have to know a lot about numerology mm -hmm. and science. Mm -hmm. There's and, a lot of physics food, references. Food processing. The Fibonacci sequence is mm -hmm. incredibly important to this. I other we, clues. We, 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 uh, we went back and forth a lot, or around and around, I guess, a lot <coughs> about the ending. Like, you had it in your head and was like, I don't know, should we really do this? And we were trying to think of something mm -hmm. different that was, mm -hmm. that was that was going to be better. And I think I, I may have that. actually convinced you to do the ending that, that we did at dinner one night. I was like, no, no, we should we should just do it. It'll be great. It'll be kind of, I don't know. Kind of, kind of ambiguous and 70s. I remember, we, I remember like, we went around and around. I kind of remember it more as an thing. iterative thing that we like did. We did one part and then we're like, let's add one more twist on the end. Mm -hmm. And let's add, you know what? And then let's add another one at the end to make it like the first one didn't count. And let's add, let's add one more. And it kept mm -hmm. getting, and it. It was hilarious. 
Well, I think this if this ending gets mentioned all the time on you know top ten best endings of computer games is the mm-hmm. ending to Monkey Island Two. And it, I it also gets mentioned on Wait, the top, wor- top ten worst endings. It's like a very controversial <laughs> see, ending. People but isn't that love perfect? It or, or they hate it in, in some ways. Yeah. I don't, I'd that's, almost that's rather make something that half the people loved and half the people hated mm-hmm. than a bunch of people something felt everybody mediocre was just about. Like, yeah, a bunch of people in between. I think on the whole, people hated this ending. Um, I think it's hilarious that Monkey Island Free just sort of gives because you float on a um, bumper car and it just didn't ever mentions the end of the game. Um, uh, and I'm really curious as to the how the return is going to actually continue on from this. What's going on? We're scolding you for running off. Your mother and I were very concerned. Thank you for hunting down your brother like we asked, Chucky, dear. You boys didn't get in any trouble now, did you? No, no sir. sir. Good. Yeah, it doesn't matter we click. You run off like that, young man. We were worried sick. You don't know what kinds of murderers and ne'er-do-wells might be hanging around a place So this like is, this. um... What's, what's the island called? Uh, this is Booty Island, isn't it? It's where you buy stuff. You could never go this far left. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, a mighty pirate. I don't have to worry about stuff like that. Of course, dear. But please be careful. Well, come on then. Let's go ride the madly rotating buccaneer. Yeah. And look at the Big Whoop Amusement Park. There we go. Oh, yeah, so that sort of invalidates one of the twist endings, as they said. So, yeah, I, I think Monkey Island 2 kind of went, oh, it's, he obviously just put him in, under a spell. Um, anyway, I'm going to be... Uh, the night is young. I'm going to be continuing on to Monkey Island 3. Oh, and the stream and start it again. I'm curious about voices. So I could have just looked up. I also should... Um, uh, summon some snails, which I enjoy doing. Uh, should put this up? Because uh, I'm streaming on Twitch right now, but I also have a YouTube channel where I put everything, and there's like 10 years worth of stuff. It's not as good quality as this, but in case you're curious, it's all there. Uh, thank you very much for watching this, of course. I'll flash that up and down, because they'll be reading the... the uh, the end credits but yeah obviously the third game has the amusement park and it sort of implies it's like a demonic amusement park and I, I think the, the return just sort of doesn't doesn't like that but I'm really curious as to what is going to be the explanation because I know it's keeping people like Murray so Murray's going to be back no there's stands right there you can see this the uh, thing for Stan Keeping Guybrush. Oh, I hope LeChuck hasn't cast some horrible spell. Yeah, okay, okay, so. She says right there, horrible spell. So, yeah. So, that's what Monkey Island 3 actually sort of went with that he. So, I'm going to be sitting here until the credits end. What time is it? Probably shouldn't make a cup of tea. Yes, I've got monkey. The, I, uh, I'm doing it quite slowly, but I believe oh, the third, the next game is going to be the easiest game, and then there's that fourth one. But I'm happy to go through them again. I'm genuinely surprised I'd never streamed them or recorded them. Uh, I did um, Day of the Tentacle. Let's mix up these snails. All these people's names. Bum bum ba da ba dum bum bum. Did I miss the voice acting people? The vocal artists?
The monkeys are listening. So I thought I'd let the whistle go for a bit. I'd rather be a pirate on scab than a scab on a pirate. I think the third one has my favourite music as well. Uh, obviously, they had to remix all these songs, though. This is quite a long <laughs> credit sequence. Hmm. How long did this take me? A couple of hours. Okay. Flash the thank you for saying up. God, the first game's credit didn't last this long. So uh, try and get my mustache as piratey as possible. Right, it's this one. Fuses to power it up. Power up mustache. This song doesn't need to be this long. <laughs> Is it, the, is it this song to the end? Oh, here's the soundtrack. Jesse, why is this song going on for so long? I, I can't whistle that high. Who's the whistler? Who's whistling right now? Okay, there we go. This is what I was interested in. So Dominic Armada, I know. Uh, Earl Bowen. I don't think Earl Bowen is in the the, the uh, later ones. Um, James Arnold Taylor. Do I know any of these? Um, I think I do, actually. Okay, I just wanted to know if Captain Dread was Phil Lamar, and it is. Uh, I, I spent the entire game not saying Hermes the Jamaican bureaucrat because I wanted to make sure it was, it was him um, but it is, it's Phil Lamar Phil Lamar's in loads of stuff uh, obviously he's Hermes uh, but uh, I think more funnily he's um, he's in um... <sighs> he's in Metal Gear uh, as Vamp uh Okay. I think it's all I know. Captain Dread. Um There we go, that's all I really kind of I I always like to watch the entire credits. <laughs> I the viewer I had is gone. Uh which doesn't surprise me. Uh since we've been listening to this whistle for ages. And I did attempt to whistle very poorly. And all the fans! That's us! Oh, we got thanked! It's one of those people. I'm I'm one of the fans, and I'm a bit worldwide. Ah, oh, they get a personal thanks though. I get a personal thanks. <laughs> They're in the. Qu I could press F one. I could summon them. I can't summon George Lucas. It'd be it'd be so much harder. <laughs> You know what? I'm going to be looking at the extras as well. I might even have this as a bonus episode because I don't think anyone ever watches these. No, I just make the last episode longer. Because it's a bit faffy that last episode anyway. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> it's the least repetitive, like... Well, it's the most repetitive song. Why did you choose this one? The least appropriate song, I was going to say. Because of the reputation. Whatever. At least we have snails. We've been here for quite some time. But aren't you glad you stuck it out because LibJPEG license? Did we got to learn now that's a thing? Thomas G. Lane. All rights reserved. Software based on part of the independent JPEG group. This is important. We did, we watched the credits. Wonder how Neva Dragon's going with four tails. San Fran. Right, bonus features. Of course, watch the Art of Monkey Islands. Have a look up. Scab Island. So yeah, that's what she looks like. Uh, Gary Chu drew these. And like, she looks like that in the next game, so. Largo looks incredibly ugly. I never imagined him quite that ugly. Yeah, like more like that. This is kind of what it looks like later on. See, that's per cell. So he's like that, but he's going to change the next game. Love that. Even though they changed it. I like her slippers. Why did you do that? That's Peter Chan. This is the new LeChuck. Some of these will be new, yeah. But yeah, these are the original pictures. So you can tell they were both derived by the same ones. This guy, like, we never saw him ever again. I don't think we ever saw this scene either, this view, or this one. I guess somebody was going to be sacrificed at some point. Mid Island. There's this guy. <laughs> I like that one. These are all new pictures, I get that. That's a great picture. This reminds me of uh, Day of the Tentacle. Doesn't have the um, extra thing there. Eh? 
Oh yeah, I know that one. Did we ever see that at night? Oh, dog. It's a house. A bit more to the house. These are nice pictures. Uh, oh, we didn't get to use these for the entire game. Oh, uh, the buttons aren't set. That's really annoying. Mother! Oh, whatever. Um. I, 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 it's a, yeah. Are any of these set? Okay. Yeah, that one's set. I just don't have mother set. That's Marley, right? This is Cliff Booty. Spitmaster. He actually called Spitmaster, he is. Great picture. See this? You see that? Yeah, I love the palette for this place. Yeah, that's interesting. So, oh, look, look, because we get to see all versions of him. Oh, it doesn't. The TV's been on. I did not realize that. Uh, how do I turn that off? So I, I, I how's we just quickly go through these again because there was a TV in the way. So yeah, let's look at Chuck as he looked in the second one. This is how they remodeled him in the first game as a ghost. That's him in Curse, of course. Uh, is that the fourth one? Because it's like a version of the third one. Okay, that's interesting. And I'm in two for again. Yeah, I completely forgot, forgot he was in the game. Cool. Alright, uh, good for you if you stuck around all that time. I'm going to let you go. Uh, I've thank you very much for watching. Been having a Monkey Island too. The Chucks escape. What? The Chucks event even. Special edition. <laughs> I'm going. Thank you very much for watching.